Okay, warning, I'm about to show you a series of pictures that aren't for the faint of heart. These pictures have the power to induce some pretty scary nightmares, so if you're okay with that, and you're okay being scared, continue the video, and if you're not, I would just, um, I don't know, watch uh, another, watch a Mr. Beast video? <laughs> well, how's it going, YouTube? Welcome back to another Most Missing Top 10 video. Make sure you guys check out the new channel right over here. We launched our brand new video. It is absolutely hilarious. If you guys are having a bad day, and you guys need to laugh, Go check out the channel. It's it's one of the funniest things we've ever produced And also I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys want to watch it after this video All right, let's get into this. This is the top 10 scariest pictures ever taken mother centipede protecting her young creeps us out in at number 10 Okay, what the heck are we looking at? This is definitely not okay I think I'm losing some of my like precious eyesight here But seriously what kind of demon monster is this and what the heck is he doing on earth? He looks like he belongs to some weird sci-fi movie from the 80s this mama centipede shouldn't be allowed to exist and how many babies is she protecting? It looks like there could be hundreds of these creepy crawlers and to tell you the truth I don't think my heart can handle this picture. So you know what? <laughs> Let's move on creepy ghosts interrupting dinner brings us to number nine Okay, let me set the scene for this next picture a family just finished eating a lovely dinner And they thought it'd be a good idea to capture this moment with the picture But little did they know that there was someone else crashing their dinner party a spooky figure can be seen hanging upside down from the ceiling I don't know about you guys But if I saw this unwanted visitor in one of my pictures you best believe I'm gonna hammer in a for sale sign on my front lawn And then I would get the heck out of there I wouldn't even need to pack a bag because who cares at that point scary Santa makes his creepy appearance in at number eight He knows when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake, but has he ever heard of a mirror? Okay? No seriously Santa what the heck happened to you, buddy? Okay, please don't bother sneaking down my chimney and bringing me gifts because I'd rather you didn't I mean who the heck did you piss off at the North Pole as a future dad? We're actually delivering in January and I'm super excited Well as a future dad if I went to the mall and saw this raggedy creepy looking Santa I would literally take my child and run back to my car. I wouldn't want them scared for life uh, Don't don't look back. Don't look back that that's not Santa a tragic zoo accident takes us to number seven in 2014 this poor man found himself in a very bad situation I mean take a look for yourselves what you're seeing is a picture that was literally taken seconds before this man was mauled to death by a white tiger somehow he managed to fall into its enclosure at a zoo over in Delhi police said that the 22 year old was drunk at the time and jumped over the fence and into the enclosure despite warnings from the guards I mean why was this guy drunk at a zoo this doesn't sound like you know my idea of a good time and unfortunately for him it definitely wasn't climbing up this list and at number six we have a possessed woman. Okay, do you guys remember these red box rental machines? Well, I don't because I'm from Canada. <laughs> I've never seen this before, but apparently you guys were able to go to one of these kiosks and rent DVDs or video games. Sounds pretty cool, right? Well, this picture is about to change everything. Is this real life right now? Is the red box performing an exorcism on this girl? No one's neck should be able to bend like this. I'm not even entirely sure if she survived this, and I guess her rental was probably late. But in all seriousness, is this the reason why red boxes were removed? I'm, I'm thinking, yeah. And now at number five, we have another picture that was captured moments before a death. During a routine scheduled maintenance, two people found themselves stranded 80 meters above the ground on top of a wind turbine. A short circuit caused the turbine to catch on fire, and the only escape route was engulfed in flames. The two mechanics had no other choice but to wait for the inevitable. They knew what their fate was going to be, and they knew it would be only a matter of minutes before they died. I mean, this is so morbid, and I can't imagine what I would be feeling if I was trapped up there, if I was in that moment I'd probably never stop fighting for my life but then again there was literally nothing that they could have done to save themselves the creepiest family to have ever existed breaks onto our list at number four I don't even think you guys are ready for this next picture so let's count it down together all right three two one and BAM yeah, I come with my own sound effects, but whoa, where the heck did this family come from? I thought my yearbook picture was pretty scary, but this family portrait definitely beats it. Who do you guys think is the creepiest? I'm gonna have to go with the dad on this one. It looks like he's super disappointed in me, and it looks like he wants to give me a whooping. Then we have mom. She looks like a gangster. This is gangsta mom who is protecting her hood, so I'll just back away now, but we can't forget about the poor kid. She can see what her future looks like, and I think it's safe to say it's looking pretty bleak for her. 
Up next, number three, we have the demon in the hospital. And no, I'm not talking about that nurse who is trying to find your vein. I'm talking about this scary looking thing on top of a patient. This picture was captured from a surveillance camera and it shows a dark, crouched figure standing on top of a patient's body who was laying in bed. The figure can be seen walking up and down the patient's body hours before he died. Some people say that hospitals are like breeding grounds for demons who gather there to wait for their next soul to die so that they can drag them to hell. Someone is watching you. Okay, who's watching me? All right, well, this comes in at number two. Okay, don't look now, but you might have someone. Sorry, I gotta look again, because this is freaking me out. But you might have someone or something behind you watching your every move. This was the case for a mother and son who were out in the yard just having some fun. When they went out there to get pictures developed, well, they noticed that they weren't alone. Are you guys able to make out the creepy face in the door? Well, I think it's safe to say that her house is definitely haunted and I wouldn't be rushing to go back inside. I'd probably just abandon my house, call it a loss, and move on with my life. Well, I would try to move on with my life. I'd have a lot of like sleepless nights, a lot of nightmares. And top of this list, at number one, we have the creepiest mask you've ever seen. During the 1960s, a man named Edward Paisnell, well, he would put on this rubber mask, break it to your home, and torture women and children. This was the only piece of evidence that the police had until the murderer was finally caught with his mask during a routine traffic stop, and this was back in 1971. So just how creepy was this mask? Well, take a look for yourselves. Yeah, you guys have no chance of sleeping tonight, at least not peacefully. This guy looks like another version of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre killer. If you guys want to have the scariest costume next year, I think we all know what needs to happen. You need to get your hands on this mask, but you may not have any friends once Halloween is over. Well, there you guys have it. You made it to the end of this video. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next Most Amazing Top 10 video.